118 chest pain. I remember one of my partners, one of the rookie officers, and I graduated from the academy, who was telling me, you're going to like working with Bill. He's killed eight people. What's the job of a police officer stripped to bare bones? It's to protect life and property. It's to enforce laws. If you embrace a mentality that the people are the enemy, you've lost what it means to be a police officer in a free and democratic society. The officers involved in the killing of George Floyd had had implicit bias training, de-escalation training, body cameras. None of that made any difference. Politicians will promise change. There will be some very minuscule legislation that they throw out there. And, and over a course of time, usually a few months, the protests go away and people forget about it. A lot of grants have gone from the federal government to local police departments, pushing them towards federal priorities, such as drug enforcement. If you look at the actions of the organization, what do you spend your time doing? What do you not spend your time doing? Where does your money go? Where does it not go? It will show you what their intentions are. My son would be alive today if that officer would have said one word before shooting. Every human being is a person's family member. Instead of looking at them as a threat, remember that violence is the actual only threat. And you should look at them as a person worthy of protecting, even if it's protecting them from themselves. It's time that we have an honest-to-God conversation about the police becoming truly a part of and not apart from the community.